Hey guys, Sarge here with the December 19th, 1941 combat replay for our 3v3 War in the Pacific Admirals Edition play by email campaign. I am going to preface this real quick and say that Shaggy is no longer a part of the team. There was internal conflict, so he had to, we had to get him out. I have taken over his area on the strategic map. It may take me a few turns to get all that into the way I'd like it. So I just thought I'd get that out there. And we'll jump right into the combat replay. Alright. Japan has officially got Miri. Which we knew it was going to happen. Japanese players did also say they wanted a longer message delay because apparently that affects how fast they see it. Doesn't make sense to me though. We have an ASW attack on the submarine that took heavy damage. Do not engage it though. More unloading at Kuching. The AK Kaiko Maru does take one shell hit. From a six inch gun. We got a lot of ASW in the Java Sea. Got another ASW attack right off of Batavia. We don't even know who spotted it, but I got spotted. And there was a encounter, task force encounter down there, but doesn't seem to have gone off. Oh, are they going out this time? Nope. Maybe they're not just not engaging. Ah, yep. They did. It was an engagement with even more PT boats. Gotta love PT boats for being set on the offensive for some reason. More unloading at Kuching. Get two more hits. We set the Haguru Maru on fire, which is nice. Uh, they have a company, uh, a fragment of a fragment of an infantry battalion. Come on. As if there didn't need to be more unloading at Kuching. They take three more shell hits from six inch coastal guns. Those will do some pretty decent damage to cargo ships. Naval movement. Fire a torpedo DD. Hey, it misses. Nice. And then deep water, you're not going to hit anything this early on in the game. That would be more patrol boats. Not sure what this is. Ah, uh, this is some AKLs that were trying to smuggle in some supply that have gotten intercepted by three heavy cruisers and three destroyers. Uh, 
Yep, that was a slaughter. And three more AKLs. Now these are small AKs. As far as I know, all these were doing was trying to smuggle in some some supply. They weren't high value ships. So we should be good there. Now we are finally under the air ops phase in the morning. I'm going to speed this up because this is going to take forever. Well, looks like it could be the last ride over Clark for these guys. Lose four planes. I did not put cap over Singapore. I had I didn't have any fighters left. I needed to give them time to get a couple planes back, as well as just give rest to the pilots. Yeah. Nah, I couldn't do anything. I can't... Though, five bomb hits. They're bombing from 10,000 feet. On fire, heavy damage. Three jakes going after a battalion or so. Bombing in China. Another 23 Sallies over Singapore. Oh, come on. Seven more damaged, one outright destroyed by flak. We have a lot of AA in Singapore, too. Another bomb hit. More bombing, this time at Chusin. Bombing at, a little bit of bombing at Wu Chow. Bombing at Temelo to slow them down. Ten casualties. Do get some bombers up. Doesn't look like they can get, just gonna get slaughtered. Get 10 bombers through. Yeah. Seven damaged planes. We do slow them down a little bit, at least that one unit. And then here comes another fragment. This time with 25 casualties. He had 14 cap. Ouch. Two destroyed plenums. Right, that will slow them down. I just needed to slow them down. A vehicle destroyed. That should slow them down. Rotation issues there. Air phase PM.
gonna skip through the all the recon. Oh, that was a lot of recon there. It looks like it was an ASW attack on one of our subs. Flooding on the Durban. More at Kuching. Deliberate attack at Clark already. This will be really. We should hold this. There's no way they attack it. They they get it already. Ooh, that one to six odds. Oh, they take 3,400 casualties to our 310. They outright lose 29 comp the bat squads. This is gonna take them forever to recover here. And for who would like it, <coughs> who would like it, this is what they're attacking with. It's a very good start at Clark. One to six odds. We only have a level one fort here. And then they're gonna take Kuching. That is a lot of force that they put down at Kuching. I'm surprised they didn't send those to like Quantan as reinforcements there. I mean, they didn't attack, I guess they didn't attack with much, but they had a lot of fragments of units at least. Right, that is the end of the turn there. Now we're on to base building shenanigans. These will give us some more points. Victory points, I should say. I wouldn't say I wouldn't say it was a bad turn, but I'm not liking that we took even more bomb hits in re on repulse. It was good that we caused 3,400 casualties at Clark, but I've got to figure something out to protect repulse better. I need to see about the Dutch fighters trying to get, maybe do long range cap or even move them into Singapore. Cause I've got to, got to defend Repulse for another day. And if that just means putting everything I can up in the air, even if they're fatigued, that's going to have to do. So... Yeah, not, it was a pretty quiet turn. Got some ships arriving. Got another tanker, which is great. GVT-16, think that was a, that may be planes. Then some troops on the west coast. Some artillery and Batan. That is the end of the phase here. Probably going to take another two or three days for them to get the turn back to us. I'm looking forward to still keeping this game going. As well as see what I can do about protecting Repulse in Singapore better. So I'll see you guys in the next one.